غَيْرُ تَعِبْ That he died in the state of of disbelief, of kufr wal iyadhu billah. to do so. What about that individual dying upon making sacrifices for the jinn or for other matters? That will go to the ulama. Not to me. Write it down so tonight we'll ask inshallah. This is exactly what he's talking about right here. He's talking about if the sin, if a person commit a sin, and that sin, he has been established upon him the legal punishment. That legal punishment will be a kafara for him. Will be an expiation for him. It will expiate that sin. Huh? Yeah. But if he, if, even if the person kill a person and he repent to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, we, we hold that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala accept his repentance. It's not like how the kuffar do. The kuffar, they will hold you. Just because you shoplifted, they will mess up your whole life. You went to the store? Right? They will mess up your whole life. Even if you made, you, 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 alhamdulillah, you repented to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. You repented to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Or you were found, D, what you call it? DU, DU, DUI, huh? DWI, right? So they could mess up your whole life. But Amma, alhamdulillah, from the rahmah of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, we commit a sin. Not only Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, you repent, He will forgive you. But you baddil sayyiatihim hasana. That Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala would change those evil actions to good action. This is why. It is incumbent upon all of us to repent to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. It is incumbent upon all of us to repent to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Sincerely. Sincerely. Having ikhlas upon our repentance. Because whoever repent, Allah will forgive him. Don't worry about what the people would think. And this, this, the society will, will almost like demonize you. Almost demonize you. Man, you evil, you this, you that. But Allah Kullin, we'll save this for next week, inshallah. So at this point, yes, Abdul Hamid, my brother. May Allah love you. Uh, <laughs> It depends. No, if a person is suffering because he's hungry, he has no money. Right. If a person is poor. Right. And he goes to a wealthy store. Right. He says, I need some water, but they're going to want to pay for the water. He takes the water, and they charge him, and he ruins his life for taking the water. But water has come from Allah. That's true. Water comes, but but from it's different. If, if this is, if you are in the lands of the disbelievers, they don't see it that way. But if you are in the land of the Muslim, that's a different case. <coughs> a person is hungry. He didn't eat for three days. He wait till the, you know, he say, hey, what is, how much is that? So the merchant turn around, he trying to climb to get it. So by the time he will just pick a few items, put it in his pocket, so the guy don't know what he did. You know, because just he's hungry. He just want to eat something. He want to eat. So this is, even in the eyes of the Sharia, this issue is dealt with in, a, in, a, in another way. So he's not to be charged for, for Barakallah Fikum, yani anything. He will be disciplined and aided. To find, alhamdulillah, a way to, you know, suffice himself. But he's not to be like how these people, the, 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 and this is uh, one of the, the, the sadness of any the lens of the disbelievers. This individual, they will ruin a person's life for that which, alhamdulillah, and he repented to Allah subhanahu. But even in that case, the person has to be patient. He has to be patient with that. Because knowing that this is, alhamdulillah, what his own hands has, you know, put forth. You got to be patient with that, that trial and tribulation. Now they, you know, they put this on your case or they put this under your belt for whole, your whole life this will follow you. Alhamdulillah, even though you have, you know, rectified your life, you have changed completely. You made a 360, you know, change. Alhamdulillah, you, <coughs> you be patient with yourself 
and seek the, 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 the mercy and the help from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. والعلم عند الله وصلى الله على محمد وعلى آله وصحبه أجمعين سنكتفي على هذا القدر. No, the murja first of all, the murja they, and as we mentioned it this morning, that the murja they, they will be having. As we say, as the Shaykh Hafizullah mentioned, that al the murjia it came from two words, one of these two. Huh? Al al raja wal wal irja. Al raja wal irja. Al raja wal irja. Al raja hope, and they say that's why hope. They say what? What did they say about that hope? La ya Very good. That the sins does not harm belief. That the sins does not harm belief. This is what they say. But this is completely in opposition of Ahlul Sunnah wal Jama'ah in how they understand what? Al Iman. Because they say, Yazidu bi ta'a wa yanqusu bi bil ma'asiyah. But for them, they say, well, if the, once the person believes, that is it. Whether he does action or he doesn't do action, it doesn't really matter. Just believe in the heart and stay on the tongue. Khalas, yakfi. Amma the action, it is mukammilat. It's not part of it. So you, you find that the, 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 this individual, they will be abandoning the actions and they will all place it that Allah is the most merciful. They will leave of the actions. So they will blend, they will put it under the what? That Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is ghafurur rahim. Oh Allah ghafurur rahim. Allah will forgive me. The guy is smoking. You tell him, man, it's haram. Oh Allah ghafurur rahim. While he's smoking. And he start fighting with some fiqh issues and the like. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala give us good in this life and they have to and allow to see his face yawm al-qiyamati wa salli lahum ala muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahibi ajma'in. Allah yibar fi. Ah, 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 ah. Gajaga.